We have just spent the night in probably one of the coolest caravan parks we've ever stayed in. 20 bucks, mate. It was so cheap. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mate. That is really good. Pretty out of it. Few, few uh, rain sounds missing for sure. <laughs> I've said it already, but we're, we're in the outback, eh? It's, <laughs> it's the best. <laughs> What's going on guys? We are back and we are in, we always say paradise, but. <laughs> it this, always feels that way though. This is actually paradise. We're in Lawn Hill, if you didn't guess it from last week's video. We're starting our day nice and early. We're on a little bit of a hike. Um, we're doing the upper gorge walk first yep. because they suggest you do it either early in the morning or late at the afternoon, because apparently it can get quite hot. Only got two days here, yep. so. Yeah, we're going to do as much as we can and keeping our fingers and toes crossed so we can get a canoe for tomorrow. Yeah. Um, because apparently the booking system is a bit of a shambles, but we're just going to yeah. keep positive that we're going to get a canoe for tomorrow. <laughs> Megan, Megan, what have we so, come to? We just come to Indari Falls and it is amazing. I we just saw this first waterfall here as we were coming down and then now we can see there's like one over there and one over there. It's, it's incredible. It's just amazing. It's then, like you can't even explain it. Eh? I know, and it's just so much greenery against the red rock. It's just so so cool. The best it's like bit Karajini fern pool on steroids. The best bit about it is it comes out of nowhere. Yeah. And then it's just paradise. <laughs> It's just amazing, just taking it in. just found this spot here and it is the perfect How spot for a photo it? opportunity. The way the trees like frame it, oh, who's going to get in it? You. Me. I reckon it's Megan's shot to get in the photo. Yeah but I have to wear a hat because my hair is so filthy. <laughs> we can get my bold head in it if you want. <laughs> but yes. Well it's your trademark now. <laughs> I reckon this is going to be an awesome shot so we'll uh, put a photo up there on the screen for you so you can get an idea of what we got. It's getting better and better. It's crazy. I this love when you do a massive. walk like this and the landscapes just change like five times. Yeah, it's gone to it's so cool. completely oh dense. I could film the um, Britney Spears, I'm not a girl, not yet a woman. Film what clip. are you yep. talking about? The Britney fans are very talking about. As soon as we decide to do a vlog, there's a helicopter ahead. Oh. <laughs> 
But yes, it is blowing us away. It keeps on getting better and better as we go further and further, eh? So we're almost at that lookout, eh? Yeah, so we've got, what, about a kilometre to go, and yeah. then we've got to get all the way back on that much water between two of us. So <laughs> great decisions were made this morning. How you feeling, Megan? Well, it's definitely become a bit challenging. We are not fit, eh? <laughs> We've lost it, guys. We've lost it completely. <clears throat> Look how high we are. <laughs> All the heavy breathing. <laughs> so we're almost at that lookout, eh? I uh, hope so. And we're hoping that it leads back to the car park. But we don't think it is going to. Yeah, Jack hates doing any hikes that aren't loops. Yeah, I like they a good can't loop. Stand going back to from one point and then back the same way he came yeah my well, hates this is living this is living i'm on top of the world i'm flying jack <laughs> that's off titanic he says i'm king of the world oh. the so that's where we're going so we are here upper gorge lookouts so yeah we might be able to come back that way around because we came this way yep Sweet. All right, we're almost there, it looks like. Let's get to it, mate. Um, the endorphins are going, eh? This place <laughs> is packed now. It is packed. We're when the we first came, people. yeah, there were only I was blah, 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 I can't talk. There was only one other car when we rubbed up, and now yeah, it's like you can't even get a car park. It's, it's insane. Well, I mean, it's school holidays. Yeah, it's not really that insane. <laughs> I don't know. But it is. It's pretty insane. It's considering um, we're in the middle of nowhere. So many troopies around as well. We saw uh, a troopie this morning with the Alu Cap conversion. And it was massive. It was huge, mate. Yeah, I think he had portal axles. Oh, I could keep talking all day about it. <laughs> Look, trippy. <laughs> uh, I was looking at the purple Jeep. That's pretty cool. Um, but anyway, we're going to head back. We're going to have a huge lunch. And we're going to try and hire the canoes. Yeah. Because it looks we so We saw cool. a few of them down there. So maybe, you know, maybe it won't be too much. Of a... Oh, my God. Look how many cars are parked down oh, here. Show, the, show them. Holy crap. That is insane. Wow, we're gonna have a long walk back up to the gorge if we do hire these canoes today. Ooh, didn't think about that, did we? <laughs> I just heard a woman say that they were all booked out. Oh, <laughs> actually, <laughs> devastated. Until First Monday. time I want to go in the water, <laughs> and they're fully booked out till Monday. Sorry, guys, we don't <laughs> get their footage for you on that. Oh, the canoes would have been amazing. Yeah. We just sold our stand-up paddleboard as well. We, yeah. we stuffed up. <laughs> Definitely. But it doesn't matter. That walk was beautiful. Yeah. That was amazing. But that's um that's spewing that that's done. That they've booked it all out, eh? Damn. We always do it. We had a public holiday or a, a school, school holidays. Days, yeah. But it is what it is. It doesn't matter. Um, it was a wicked time. We're gonna go into Adele's Camp Grove now. And uh, I Adele's reckon Go Grove oh, Camp. Ad Adele's Grove Campground. Um, and we're going to see how busy that is going to be. <laughs> No canoes, but we did hear that there is a water hole just at the end of this caravan park. So, I'm gonna go have a look. Maybe dip, dip a toe. Our toes in, mate. Maybe. And uh, just see what's around, eh? Yeah, it's not a bad little caravan park. We did say um, 
last time we went to a privately owned campground just to visit a national park we said we'd never do it again because it was 50 bucks and it was absolutely shocking and here we are and here we are but i think so far this one is better than the last one that we went to definitely have a look at that we even got uh, a viewing platform here whoa no crocs anyway we're going to go find this uh, waterfall eh? Mm -hmm. water water hole <laughs> How busy was that, eh? That was way too busy, oh my god. <laughs> Crowds are not for us, eh? No. But we found a little oasis, baby. How is it, Megan? Oh, it's good. Refreshing. It's actually a hidden oasis here, eh? Yeah. It was so busy over there. Much better than the actual swimming hole, but yeah. uh, I just hate that. I hate that slimy feeling on the bottom of Classic. things like this, but no, nah, it's really nice. So the caravan's a big plus for us. Definitely come here. Just book in advance if you want ca uh, canoes. Uh, canoe, yeah. That was a disaster. But other than that, it's pretty good. Yeah. What Can't are we really... doing tonight? Oh, uh, yeah. So we said, because we couldn't get the canoe, we're going to spend that 50 bucks that we would have spent there. And we're going to go to the bar and restaurant here oh, yeah. instead. So got 50 bucks to spend on ciders maybe probably gonna spend more than that <laughs> but uh we're just gonna spend the rest of the day here and we'll see you at dinner time and see I'm what we get try and get jack in the water for the first time on the whole lap of australia this is uh as close as you'll see me <laughs> to the water <laughs> but anyway we'll see you tonight for dinner driving through days and nights won't stop for traffic lights Nugget. <laughs> looks like a nugget straight out the freezer. How's the cold sauce? $50 gourmet meal. <laughs> <laughs> Classic. Beer's going down perfectly. It's getting busy. So how was your $28 chicken nugget? <laughs> Ridiculous. It was literally just a giant chicken nugget. <laughs> that I reckon they've just dropped straight in the frying pan. No, in the oven. Not, not very happy, guys. My fish was not bad. <laughs> just a chicken nugget. I'm really <laughs> devastated. But the chips were good. The chips always seem to be good. <laughs> but uh, yeah, no. Nah. If you come in at Adele's, don't get the bloody chicken schnitzel. Because it was shocking. It's like it came out of the car. Actually, I'm just going to be quiet. <laughs> because I would just keep rambling and rambling. Dinner was brilliant. <laughs> but don't get the chicken schnitzel. Ooh, troopy, look. It's got a bloopy. Ooh. Anyway, we're going to, uh, I don't know, what are we doing now? Probably just go to sleep. I'm knackered, aren't you? I've this had... is our first hike in so long, it feels oh, like. Knackered. I've had two beers and I can feel it. It's pretty bad, eh? Lightweight. Might have to uh, buy a carton and get working on that <laughs> beer gut, mate. Anyway, let's go have a chat with these guys. What, in the, the trophy. <laughs> we'll see you in the morning. Holy. Oh my god. We've just hiked, what's this place called, Megan? Uh, Constance Range. Const Walk, I think. Constance Range, and uh, also good morning on that note. Uh, we weren't going to vlog this morning's little hike, but uh, have a look at the view, mate. Oh, that was so worth it. It was so hard to get out of bed this morning. It was pretty hard. <laughs> um, my god, look at that. Look, I always say look at that, but look at that. <laughs> 
worth it up here. Breakfast time. Look at all that delicious bread that's going to bloat us after our intense hike. Um, what's the plan, Megan? Uh, well, oh, heaps of stuff coming out today. First thing is breakfast, obviously. Yep. Oh wait, I can keep that in here, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, and then we were going to start making our way towards the Northern Territory border. We're in a pickle. We're in a bit of a pickle with the old COVID lockdowns, so yeah, I don't I'm know. Not really sure what we're to gonna do. do. At the moment, but we're gonna wait. We're gonna head to Mount Isa, I think. Well, that yeah, that's the other thing as well. This is like the very last of our groceries, and yeah. um, I'm not sure where the next like proper grocery store is. So. I think it's Mount Isa. But it's like a four hour drive away. Yeah. And in the opposite direction of the water. So, so we're, I think we're going to go to Mount Isa <laughs> and we're going to wait to see what Alice Springs does with their lockdown situation. And then we're going to hopefully go to Northern Territory, otherwise we're in a big pickle. Stuck in the, in the outback, mate. But uh, yeah, we're going to have some breakfast and we'll see you Mount Isa. We have made it to Mount Isa finally. That was the roughest road. I pumped the tires up and then corrugations came. So I had to let them down straight. <laughs> How annoying, eh? I had to let them down again. But uh, we just made it to Mount Isa. Pumping up the tires. We've got to smash out coals. We've got to get to Super Cheap Auto to get a new air filter. And then we have to drive another hour back to a free camp spot that we found. Oh, is it an hour away? Yeah, it's an hour. <laughs> so we've just done like how many hours of driving? So much driving. Um, I still haven't finished this bloody edit. Megan's trying to get an edit done and it's just taking ages. And but so we're, Don't we're, ever tell yourself, oh, I'm just going to mask out from behind a tree and it'd be really cool because <laughs> it's so time she's, consuming. <laughs> she's doing some fancy editing stuff, but it, it'll be worth it. Um, yeah, so we're just pumping up the tyres and uh, just stop this thing from doing this. And uh, we're going to do all that and then, yeah, I learnt some pretty crazy, uh, not crazy, I learnt some very valuable, valuable lessons today. Um, drive to the conditions on corrugated roads, because I was not, and it was a huge mistake. We hit a washout, probably at just over 80 kilometres, and the front end just went Oh, straight in, wheels, I think the front wheels came off the floor at some stage. Stuff fell out of the console, went out the window. Um, so very valuable lesson there. I will not be doing that again. I'll be driving to the conditions for sure. Second one is not a valuable lesson, but I think I, I should have known this already. Red dust gets everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> it I feel is like everywhere. It's worse here than when we went up north in yeah, it's WA. Like a, it's, it's like a little powder. Finer, yeah. yeah. It's getting in every nook and cranny. So that's another thing. I got to go to car wash. Oh yeah. We got to smash out so many things. <laughs>
bloody vacuum out. This is so needed right now. Oh my god. It's so, wait, I wonder if you can see this on camera. Ready? Do it again. Can you see it? <laughs> no, you can't. Oh see my it. god, it's so much. There is like there is red dust everywhere along here. I don't. Oh yeah, I can see how it got there. And then you open up here, and it's just it's just a disaster. <laughs> <laughs> my hat's gone red. Um. So. What is the plan after we get cleaning? So, pretty bloody tired. Today was a big day and like we oh, didn't even... We didn't even get here. Yeah, that brings us to not even washing the car. Oh to tell yeah. Them. <laughs> I was going to say we didn't even do all of the things on our to-do list. The car wash was like 2.3 metre yeah. height restriction so we couldn't fit in the car wash. What kind of car wash? Oh, listen to me like just ranting <laughs> behind the camera. It was absolutely fuming. <laughs> <laughs> hey. I was not happy. <laughs> but anyway, um, and there was something else that we couldn't do. So we, we couldn't go to the car wash. Yeah, and, and then we, we didn't do the laundry mat. Well, we really <laughs> needed to do laundry. We wouldn't have had time anyway, but like, oh my God, this is all dirty washing right now. Classic. <laughs> so much. Yeah. But um, yeah, we're just gonna, we found this really nice free camp. It's nice and quiet, except for us shouting about the car wash. It is pretty good. Um, <laughs> it's on the, on the side of a highway, but it seems all right. And um, yeah, we're just gonna wait out here, I think for, well, obviously at least tonight, maybe tomorrow. We're gonna see what's happening with the borders. Um, Darwin has come out of their lockdown, but I don't know, you never know with these sorts of things. So we might just hang around maybe one more day just to see what's going on there. Yeah, we just wanna play it safe. Yeah, exactly. So it's a uh, nice, healthy dinner tonight. The old Milo cereal strikes again. I mean, a bit of skim milk doesn't hurt. That's the healthy part, eh? <laughs> there you Thank go. Thank you. Look at that. Made dinner for you. Are you going to come? Yeah, yeah. Just grab mine. Oh. Alrighty. How does it taste? I don't even taste I'll it. I'll put a lot of effort into it. <laughs> go on. <laughs> well, guys, we're sitting in paradise again at a free camp spot. Road trains driving past, they're so loud. This is an unusual thing, by the way. This is just because we <laughs> may or may not have been tempted by McDonald's while we're in town. Because, like, we've been driving all day with pretty low <laughs> stuff. So, double quarter pounder for me. <laughs> oh, it was delicious. I don't know why that justifies eating cereal for dinner, but in my mind, it does. So, <laughs> <laughs> anyways, but no, I think we're set for another good sunset we'll yep. probably wrap this one up here i reckon mm -hmm. next episode fingers crossed will be in the northern territory hopefully but if you enjoyed the episode make sure you like subscribe if you're new and we will see you next time thanks for watching see you later Since we've hit the territory, mate. Sounds funny to say, eh? I'm in the territory. There is flies everywhere. I've just given up on them. <laughs> They're all over the camera right now. Look, there goes one. <laughs> I find it so funny. I don't know why. <laughs> Especially when you see like a little family, like a little one's got baby clothes on. It's so funny. Yeah, there was one with one guy with a hat on, looked like he'd uh, had a few beers. But I would not recommend it. It uh, did not feel safe at all. Oh, like a mimosa. Yeah, can I get a mimosa, oh, please, in the middle of the afternoon? I'm lost for words. <laughs> <laughs> not impressed.